Greetings family, this is Bomani Tamba and we are live on Revolutionary Camping Family. I'm at the Arts and Culture Center or the National Center of Arts here in Accra, in the city of Accra family, in this beautiful city and this is one of the most incredible shopping area. Uh, so this is a nice little visitor and welcome center and shopping information. So we're going to let you to see what is going on here. So, lots of beautiful shopping. Ladies' paradise of shopping. Here at the Arts and Culture Center. I can't hear you. I can't, I can't hear you. Hey, how's it going? I can't hear you. Uh, no, I know you are so good, man. You know, you're African man. Well, we're pushing for them to shop. This is how we get people to come uh, by encouraging them. Exactly, so you're right. You are my, right. My brother wants us to shop, so family, he's encouraging you to come to the art center and come exactly. shop with him and his brothers. Too black, too strong. Too black, too strong. There you go. And this is my good brother right here. Uh, uh, come on, let's go take a look at your shop. Uh, yes. I'm gonna, my family, uh, it's too many shops to show you, so what we're gonna do is show you a few shops. Yes. But once you come to the art center, you just make your way around. Yes. Yes. Let's go to my shop. And so every time I come, I try to this uh, feature yes. one or two shops or a few shops or this yes. the whole center. Yes, we make it for myself. It is a whole lot of this uh, clothing, oh, artifacts, you know, all that good stuff. We want to see crafts. Oh, would we, can we go again? Yeah, just, just look. Just, just look. I'm encouraging them to come. See, that we're shopping. Unfortunately, sometimes family, we can't buy from everyone. That's always going to be the issue. So just uh, do your best, show love, and then we're all good. And as a matter of fact, there's another shop right here. And this, uh, our members seem to love this one right here. Yeah, you are the man. You here we go. You are the man. I remember you last year. You come here it's and the come here. So what I always encourage everyone is to make sure they have signs with their numbers, email, and any other information. That way, they can be prepared for business coming in. So you know, that's one thing we're encouraging for us to all step it up to another level. Got my, got my, got my, got my you know, as you can see family, we're wearing the green Africa for the Africans uh, t-shirt. This is the 2023 Ghana version. Yes, my brother, greetings, good to see you. Good to see you too. Yes, good to see you. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Good. Yes, brother. Welcome. Let's go take a look at the shop. Yeah, yeah, okay, shop let's go. So, please tell me you have a sign and you have a yeah, number on here. there. I mean, yeah, I'm going to tell you to sit down. Yes, be always beautiful right there. Okay, now you're going to sit down. 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 Okay, now you're going to sit this is my place. Oh, well, I'm looking for your signboard. I don't see any information up there. How we know to contact you? There's no information. Yes. No, where's your name? Name. Oh, the dust cleaning. Are you really gonna give me that excuse, brother? <laughs> and family, for those who are watching everything, I'm, you know, I'm not being disrespectful. I'm just trying to encourage my brothers to just, uh, market themselves because they have great products, and you know, in order to you for you to sell great products, you have to do great marketing, and you have to also give people access to your information to communicate. Thank uh, you. So I'm just encouraging that, just like the same thing I did when I went to. Uh, the yeah, wood carving village in Avery. Yeah, Avery. And, and same thing I do when I go to other countries and other places, you know, because I want to see us as black people compete on a higher level. And I want to see us all build our business for success. So I'm always learning myself, and then you know, things I learn, I share, and then I learn from, you know, we learn from each other. Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Iron sharpens iron. Surely. Yeah, yeah. Surely. Just like they say in the Bible, right? There you go. Yes. Yes. So let's uh, take a look. More look. And take it on it. So where does all the... Uh, and you see the rough one? Does the... Now, is, is this coming from the northern region or yeah, it's yeah. coming from this here in Accra? In, yeah, in Accra. So you guys do wood carving here in Accra? Yes, yes, right. yes. 
Oh yeah, that's that's right on the other side. Yeah, he's so family. Look at this right here. So this is the the unfinished version. So once you you know put a paint on it, it's gonna be nice and this yes. it's gonna look like one of these finished versions over here. Come to finish to come to like this. But I've also seen where uh, See the, the guys one? take a block of wood and they chisel this thing out, and it's impressive. Yes, yes, yes. I mean. You, I mean, you, you can't make any mistakes. You only have so many room for mistakes. So, yes. as a matter of fact, our lighting is bad. Come this way so we can get some. There you go. See, and then look at this complete version. And so all of this is real wood. Yes. Real wood. Real, like real tree wood, not uh, fabricated wood. Mm -hmm. So that's the thing I love about, uh, you know, when you're here shopping in Africa, shopping in countries like Ghana. Yes. Yeah. You see the drop? Is this one wood? Yes, one wood. I'm telling you, it's impressive. I just sometimes can't believe it myself. But, and if I didn't see actual artisans literally chisel this out, I wouldn't believe it. But that's why we go to the wood carving village so we can actually see these. Wow. So, so people going people to want to know how do they get in touch with you. So again, if you want to put it up there, and if you have a card, you can put it in the screen and show. Or give it, give your name so people my know who to look for. My name is Tairu Shop 15. Tairu Shop 15. 15. Yes, yeah, one five. One five. Sure. And so, how do they call you? You have a phone number. A phone number. My phone number zero two seven eight two nine seven eight six one. My name is Tayu. Here you go, fam family. Our good brother here, you know, just gave me a nice little exclusive of his beautiful shop, and you know, she's looking for some support. And the next thing he's gonna do is he's gonna put his nice sign up front with his information. Thank you very much. Yes, absolutely, brother. Let's let's do this, man. That way, I can bring more people back to your shop. Thank you. It's for mine. Just feed you. Mine. Yes, brother. Yeah, just feed you. This is my shop. No. And this shop is called ID here yeah. 46. Yeah. Exactly. And there's no contacts on here. Yeah. Where's your phone number and my your email phone address? Number, my phone number no, is your phone number has to be up there. That yeah, way. Yeah. No, this one is not my phone. It's my team number. Yeah, this is my team number. Yeah, this video I see here to my shop. Welcome to my highlight. Yeah, this is my highlight. This is some expensive artwork. We got the chest going on here. That's, it, fam. That's how we do it. You know, a game of chess, a game of strategy and tactics. That's how we operate. You know? Tacticians. The bronze red green sister, how are you? I'm fine, how are you? Yes. Enjoy paradise. Which one? I'll come back. Give me money. You know, I'm going to leave this area because uh, I need to get back to the front. And I'm hopefully. You know, Chanka Chakari. Uh, you see Chanka yeah, Chakari? You know, inspired, encouraged some of our brothers to set their game up on their marketing of their shops. All right. And this is, you know, my favorite example of this uh, marketing your shop. Yeah, so this is the example right here. Look, you know, you got PO box, got email address, got phone numbers, yeah, all that good stuff. And for those who know me, that's just me being me. I just, I just want to see us progress. I want to see us just compete harder. And that's why over the last few years we come on African Liberation Day, May 25th. Mm -hmm. Another good example. And now we're back up here, we're back to the bus area.
So that's just one part of the art center. I can go all the way to the other side uh, and show you a whole lot more. But it's uh, similar things in uh, most of the shops. Uh, and everybody got their beautiful t-shirts on. You know? And this is the back of the t-shirt right there. So we just switch up the colors work them around so we can have red, black, green and gold. The colors of the nation, the colors of Ghana. And this is Mr. Bomani Dakari. And these are the mobile guys that go around, uh, bring a few uh, pieces with them, and then they just out here and they just, you know, they negotiate and they're trying to make some sales. <laughs> so as soon as the bus comes up, you know, you have, you have some of the smart, uh, you know, yeah, yeah. Uh, smart sellers. And they just come right to the bus and then just try to make the deals with you and display their products. And so you have a whole other section right here and further down it's a whole lot of uh, drumming and artwork being created. And this used to be one of the main entrances. Once you come on in, you end up seeing this sign right here. Yeah, so, it's, so we call it the uh, Arch and Culture Center or the Center for National Culture. And everything that you see here represents you know, culture, the, the way of life of how things are in Ghana as far as the clothes, even, you know, even from you know, soccer jerseys, different, uh, different uh, artifacts and different, I would say craft in general. And I love this area right here. This is where you get all the soccer jerseys. Yes, brother, yes. And I'm Unfortunately, I'm not going in or going back. So the best I could do, family, is to show you this front part. And uh, what you're seeing is similar to what you're going to find in the back. Some shops may be a little more in detail on certain things. And this is a little bit different. Uh, brother's got the bags, the baskets, and he got true arts men at work. And then you have a whole energy of just drums. Yeah, hey, you're back for the factory. <laughs> Uh, this is the drum factory in Ghana. You see that? This is a brother from another mother. And so, family, you can keep on going and keep on going. And there's more shops. So, from this point all the way to this point, it's just not but uh, shops.
selling like the shops here have like uh, 200 and 200 and 250 shops. Yes, unfortunately I can't walk that far, but uh, you know. Yeah, one. Yeah, yes, brothers, yes. Yes, my brother, yes, my brother. The best way arts and drum. See, this is another great sign right here. Yeah, so when you see these signs with uh, phone numbers, be free to reach out to them and you know, connect. And there we go, family. The world is Africa. And that's why we say Africa for the Africans. This is who we are. Yes, so family, the journey yes. continues. Africa is in the S, yeah. so it's ours. And before we close, once again, my good brothers at Best Way Arts and Drum. And then you have another, you have many other sections of this great, yeah, great drums. And, and you also see some of the brothers just doing the chiseling of the chiseling of the wood to make the drums. Yes, Kwabna, it's time to go. Let's yes. rock and roll. Yes, it's time to go. Yes, so family, we are us. done here in the Arts and Culture Center. And we're yeah. on our way to Independence Square. So you can see the 1957 independence. So yes, family, the journey continues.